So we have arrived on our next holiday adventure. So we're in Miami here for four days and then we go up to Fort Lauderdale to the port and on a two week cruise back to Southampton. So we're actually away for nearly three weeks. So a bit of a um, long holiday trip back home. So this is the hotel we're staying in for four days in Miami. This is huge. This room is actually huge. A little stairs long. Massive great TV. The aircon's on, it's nice and cold. Yeah, look how wrong this room is. This is huge. So we're at a hotel. This is day two and we're just waiting for our taxi to take us shopping. We got a shopping day for day. Just gonna walk around. Last night we had dinner just across the road, some loads of different restaurants and eateries. Oh look, there's a little funny creature. Ooh, who's that? There's a little lizard. Hello. Hello. Yes, you. We're not far from the airport. Let's go and see what they got. <laughs> Just going around the back of the hotel. And um, I didn't even know it had one. But they got a gym, there's a laundry service, so you can do your own laundry, which would be handy because we can do some laundry before we go on a cruise for two weeks. And I found this. We got a pool as well. Oh yes. We'll be definitely going in that later. And today we are going on an airboat to the Everglades to go and see some alligators and get up a bit close and yeah go on an airboat that should be fun so we're just waiting for our ride to pick us up apparently it's a big yellow minibus Boats. Quite a few boats here. So we're just uh, waiting, just being dropped off. We're just waiting for our man to um, park up and get us all signed in. Hi guys. Hi. Hi. Two. Last row, opposite side of the boat. Watch your noggins on the way in. Going first. Going first, and then this like, one. Last one. Hi. How many? Three. Oh, so we will try to go as fast as possible. you know before entering an actual speed trail so you can grab any items that could get lost like hats glasses cell phones and cameras because if you lose anything during out the speed trails let alone at any other location of the tour whatever went into the water becomes official property of that relates 
speed trail. So please gather and secure your items. We're about to take off. Show me all 80 teeth, 40 on top, 40 on the bottom. 
If you look at the back of his throat, it appears he has little to no throat opening. He has an oversized palatal valve or glottis, which allows him to go underwater, capture food without drowning. He would usually then serve as above the water to swallow that food. Whoa, last trick, no hero stuff. Hey, 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 listen. Suitcase thing can still happen, my friend. <laughs> Look at me. I make one phone call, you're full of zippers. <laughs> I can have you in check baggage right next to Thursday. That's a joke, you know what <laughs> Sometimes people clap. <laughs> Amazing, by the way. I believe that is <laughs> you got the whole pool to yourself. Your very own pool. <laughs> it's 33 degrees out here. It must be warming up a bit. Go on, just bomb in. No, no. So today, day three. Day three. Day three. Today we are going to Miami Beach. Lincoln Road Mall. Mm. You're in Miami Beach. Are you happy to be here? <laughs> My name is Rick and I will be your tour guide for the next 90 minutes. We have Captain Peter today. How about a big round of applause for your captain? He lives for the applause. We will see Prince with his guitar. There he is. There's Jackie Gleason. That's Muhammad Ali, Versace, and Madonna. Oh, someone smashed in part of Versace. <laughs> they all have history here on South Beach. There's the Club Madonna, in case anybody is interested. 9 p.m., ladies, you can make some money while you're in town. Outside through City Hall up on, 20, uh, up on 17th Street. And behind it, we're gonna see the police station. I have nothing to say about it. Stay away from it. Our number one diner, I love it. The 11th Street Diner. This Art Deco dining car diner was built in New Jersey back in 1948. Hello. You see the vacant lot with the two white boats behind it? The larger white boat to the right in the Mediterranean home belonged to David Beckham. The two brown tiki huts and the two small white boats, that is the estate of Gloria Estefan. She's lived there since the early 90s. Here we go, you guys ready? Want to get a little loud? Yeah. Oh. Oh, at least we can see the top of it. They just trimmed those trees a little. The largest property is right there. Over a hundred million dollars for that place. It belongs to the billionaire dermatologist, Dr. Philip Frost. Sell colors, hoping to attract the art world, the fashion world in Hollywood. Bring back tourism, it worked like a charm.
furious fans of your oh look it's exactly the way it was in the movie remember the third movie they jumped in now they were coming from the city going towards the island across the bay to the left of this bridge you will see the perez art museum the frost science museum there's the scorpion tower the law stated back in the 30s if you took a building above three floors you had to put in an elevator goes for miles and miles and miles and miles and more beach. Need to stay on that one. Sorry. <laughs> We're gonna go cycling around Miami. We're gonna go cycling around Miami. Well we <laughs> we think we are. Let me let me go off ahead. Let me see. see if you crash.
actually tracks with this road. Well, that was Point fun, though. wasn't it? I might tell you. I don't think. Huh. Yeah. <laughs> that was fun. Oh, my legs are like wobbly though. <laughs> oh, the fish was all swimming earlier. I'm sure they were. today so we've got one behind us right one can't see the name from here we've got another Royal Caribbean Liberty of the Seas there's another one we've not been on and then over there we've got another two we've got a Disney cruise over there and uh, not sure what that other one is can't see from here what a busy day I'm calling on you so DJ Give me a floor filler this time. Let's get this next floor full of people. Come on. So day six of our three week holiday. And this is day two of our two week cruise home. And uh, we've just arrived at Perfect Day at Coco Cay. Royal Caribbean's own private island. Look at them beaches. Ha 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 
team number three, what is your name? Cinnamon. Cinnamon! What a name! Okay, Cinnamon, let's try your stuff. So we've been at sea for seven days straight now. Since we left uh, Coco Cay, um, this transatlantic cruise, and we're just about to cross over the line for Europe. So we're now entering Europe, um, and they have a welcome to Europe party, which we're just about to go in into the room and wait for us to cross the line. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Welcome to Europe Day.
subscribe button and then the little bell icon and it'll let you know when new videos get uploaded.